Hi there, everybody. Good morning. How you doing? We are playing Deliver Us Mars once again. We're continuing with this. We have a very injured teammate, crewmate, whatever you want to call him. And we are looking for medication. We also, I, I've been thinking about this. Um, we've seen, here we are on Mars, and we've seen where they work. We've seen the quarry that they work at. Now, right now, we're on the ship. I think that they landed on. But we still haven't seen where they live. And there's nobody. We haven't found anybody yet. So there, if there are any people on this planet, they're off somewhere. We don't know where. Um, and I'm hoping that we find them. I think that we will. But right now, we got to get medication because our, our friend is very sick and... That looks like beer. Can't I just sit here and drink the damn beer? Is that possible? Don't I deserve this? Nobody said none. I guess I don't. All right. Uh, take picture. Did you write this down for later? Crayon pod. Uh, hello, Noodle. My, uh, <laughs> sorry. My, uh. My pet snake's light just came on, so, um, uh, that's Noodle. I, I want to say good morning to her, but now is when she go to sleep because she's nocturnal. Anyway, let's look around. Let's see if we can find this medication. He mentioned the name of medications that we're supposed to get, but the names were so long, I don't expect that we're supposed to remember them. Uh, okay. Gotcha. Hmm. Yeah, uh, all right. So I'm just gonna look for anything that I can find that's... Oh man, we've, we've gone up a long way, I didn't realize. So just looking for whatever I can pick up. Hello? Man, there's a lot of... And this is just on the ship! Okay, I'm, I'm starting to question... Why did they leave? <laughs> you know? I, I mean... I understand they moved to Mars and they want to get out and they want to be it, but this ship is big enough. Everybody could have lived here. They got a hospital. I mean, this hospital is huge. Medical facilities. Why did they leave the ship? I don't know why. What do you want? You want me to collect you? I did it. You should jot that down. I did. Show it up. Oh. Put back. Uh. Nor. Nor. Nor this drone. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. I, I do not know how to pronounce medication. I. You know. It just. That would be the hardest part. If I ever learned. If I ever went to school to be a doctor, I would never be able to pronounce medication. I would not be able to do it. All right. The. I mean, the only medication I can pronounce is aspirin. I can say that. That's about it. Okay. Um, anything in here? Do I? I do have a flashlight. There it is. I had to remember which button because it's R, which is usually reload, but not in this game. Okay, I... We found... A medication, but I guess it's not... Not the kind we needed. Okay. Oh, what? Scan? Oh. A family photo. Oh, okay, Rosa, that's the doctor who's here. Right. She's the doctor who's like saying, hey, look, your your dudes are sick, and they're they're getting burned out, and they need rest. And the guy's like, work, damn you, which is not a good way to, that's not gonna help anybody. Um, okay. And if I, oh, okay. Well, we got this. Let's figure out a hologram. All right, okay. Whoop, wrong way. And, uh, go back in and there. Hey, come on. There we are. Ah, man. You gotta do the two thing to me. Wait, is this? No. I, I mean, I don't know. Okay, that's there. Oh. Oh, I- wait! Ah, I hit the- My fault! Oops, let me do that again. 
Okay. Spin around and... Uh... Okay. No, not... Oh, boy. There we are, and... There. Okay. Now... Nah, oh, I only had to do one. Good. You'll all be escorted back to your chambers. Report to your superiors for the graveyard shift. I'd heard you got an Isaac to help you out on this little project. That's a true. project I made very clear wasn't going to happen. People need help, William. People need to work. If they spend nights here and off the work rosters, it only halts the progress even more. Besides, we need to keep this wing open for pregnancies. Ah yes, all the pregnant women in the colony. Best leave some beds open to them rather than real people who need real rehabilitation. Are you saying pregnant women aren't real people? But I didn't Is that what you just said? Rehabilitation, did I? What did I walk in on, Rosa? Opposition? This place is collapsing, William. The dust storms are wearing down our walls and roofs. The mutations in Odom speak for themselves. We are cooped up inside on a planet we shouldn't be on. There is no way this will work. We have to return to Earth. These hardships are the cost of evolution and progress. We will push through. After everything that's happened over the past few years, do you seriously think that we're better off here than we were on Earth? Security will be down to put everything back the way it should be in an hour. Well... Thanks for the backup. I'm sorry. I don't understand you, Isaac. You hear the same voices in the hallways. We've put years into this place and it's not working. Not enough space, not enough food, not enough progress. Why are you staying quiet? It's just not that simple. People left their families to come here. You left your family to come here. Isn't it time you saw them again? <sighs> hmm. Isaac, wait. I'm sorry. That... Okay. So... Her dad... Even though he left, um, really apparently doesn't think that this is going well. He misses his family. We know that much. But he's also not doing anything to stop what's going on. That's really, I, I love all the, like the decorations and the details they put in this game. Now where, where? Where? I'm, I shouldn't question it. I really shouldn't, but I'm sitting here. My brain is going, where did you get paper? There's no trees on Mars, but I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do it. I'm not. Uh, okay. Now, look, we got to get some meds. I'll make a note of this. Prison accounting prison. You have prison here? Why would you have prison? You would think that if there's only like a hundred people or so, that... You should write this down for later. That none of them would be stupid enough to break a law. Uh... Okay, what... What's this for? What is this for? There's not a... There's nothing I can hit with it. Well, there's not a... I mean, I'm just sure there's plenty of things I can hit with it. I'm gonna hit this robot with it. No. See, there's there's nothing... That is that? No. Huh. Well, may... Okay. I, I'm not gonna jump ahead. I'm like, well, there's nothing to hit with it. That's dumb. Because I may be able to aim it out the door. And there may be a splitter somewhere. Right? Ryan? found an entire section MacArthur transformed into a makeshift Jail. prison. Yeah, what? Violence, destruction, stealing. They're all here together. Why would they do this to each other? It doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I was asking that just now. Well, doesn't feel that way anymore. Maybe. Huh. Uh, I don't know. I... Can, will this open? Nope. I don't know why people would... I mean, scientists especially. People that, you know, would come here. Oh, hey, I got past the blockage on the stairs. Um, I don't know why people would 
scientists would come here to another planet and then just start like busting people up or breaking laws. Why? Doors locked. But I can hook it up to the stream point to get us in. Great, do it. Okay. Uh Bobot, I need you, buddy. Um oh, or Okay, I thought I needed you, buddy, but apparently I don't. Can I... Uh, um, wait, what? Hang on... Oh, here I am, I'm in here. Oh, I'm getting kind of far away. Uh, alright. I do not know what I need to do right now. Oh, I see... You know, it might help if I turned on the light. There we go. Okay, so... I'll leave that on. Okay. Let's see what we got in here. Because we got some... points that we got to shoot... a laser at. It's Even though it's not a laser. And we got this, which we can't open. We tried that. So, nothing in here I can open. I mean... You know, I gotta be able to... Wait a minute. Uh, so I'm gonna wind up over there, I can tell already. Are, are you sure? Are you positive, Bobot, that you cannot open this? No? See, that's the one thing I thought the Bobot would be able to do. Oh, wait a minute. No, there's that, but... Um, hang on. Let me look. Okay, and now we're in here. And now... No. There's nothing else. Damn! Alright, alright. Let me figure out what to do. Oh wait, wait, whoa! What about this? Uh... Ooh, hey, hey, hey! Oh ho ho ho! I think I done figured it out! Right. Okay, now that this is open... Alright. Let's get you out of there. Thank you very much, by the way, Bobot. You're awesome. Okay. Oh, uh, right. Let's take this. Let's put it out of here. Bonk. And let's fire this. Yeah. Shoot that! Kill it! Oh, uh -huh, you weren't gonna kill anything. You just thought you were, and you're dumb. Okay. Well, let's see if I can... Okay. That is not working. But this one is. Wait a minute. I think... Pick this up. Okay, wait a minute now. Put that back. Get rid of that one. Okay, no, it's too... Wait. Okay. Um... So this opens one door, but it's not strong enough to open another one. Well, uh, wait a minute. Is this open now? Can we... Okay, no. Alright. But we can get in here! And what is this, may I ask? And, um, can I... Okay, no. But I can grab this. What are this? Hello? Is this... This is something that dampens, isn't it? So, I need to put that here. Right? So I can... Dampen this beam so it'll open this door. Yeah! So we good now. And I can do this. Alright. I got it, we figured it out, we done it, it's cool. Oh, and this looks like a pharmacy too, which is exactly what I want. That's no ordinary ARC button, is it, Ayla? Huh? Mm -hmm. How are we supposed to up... Wait a minute, what? 
That's pretty handy, Ayla. Got yeah. Any other tricks up your sleeve? I uh, I think I see some medication here. Maybe it has some of that Praga Benton stuff. Huh. Good job. Perfect. Okay, so I have to wonder now. This will work. Huh. And these are antidepressants. And a lot of them. Strange. Wasn't living on Mars the dream for these folks? Where do they get the antidepressant? I don't think there's a Pfizer on Mars! Alright, I think that might be everything we can find here. I'm gonna bring these up to Sarah, and then we can figure out a way up. I might have an idea. Um... Do you want to climb that? No. <laughs> well, that might be the only way if everything else is blocked. You can't go up alone. It's fine, I've climbed worse. Oof. Well, if I fall, that's the end of me. Look, I'm the only one that can work the stream point, and you need to go and help Sarah. It's too dangerous. I'll be fine. God, I love the music! Just be careful. I will. Ah. Okay, the that that's it. The music has literally stopped me from talking like more than once now, like a few times, just so I can hear the music. So, music, five stars. I I love the music. All right, so I we got the medication, but and we got into here, but it doesn't. And it's weird, by the way, that they're talking about, well, there's so many antidepressants. I mean, I know I made the joke a minute ago about, oh, there's no way to, um, you know, get it. I'm, maybe they're making them. But I also get the point that they're awfully depressed as well. Okay, so we can get back in here. What are we doing with this? Why is this like this? Um, I don't understand. Um, is there another thing? that I need to be aiming that beam at. So I don't see it. I don't know why there's, um... Oh, wait a minute. There's this. What the hell is this for? I don't know, but... Uh, let's figure it out. Let me grab this. Another splitter, right? Yeah, okay. Off we go. I'm gonna put this right here. Um, Kabam! See, I'm an expert at this. This is what I do. That's why I'm here. It's to direct beams around. I'm the beamy dude. You, you want to know something about beams? I know all about beams. Just don't even try me. I was like, oh, beams? I know about beams. I know exactly what I'm beaming. Um, okay, that's got to stay open. Missing. Maybe no. I can use the splitter that got me in here. Look, we need to, we need to not do that to me. Oh, wait, um, I'm going to take this because it doesn't matter now. I, uh, um, wait, why did that, okay, it didn't go down. Uh, I, okay, that's too low, so I need to actually have that going. Um, I don't know if I need this in here or not. I'm gonna stick it here. Uh, I'm gonna take this other beam, because I don't need that beam no more. And I'm gonna send it over there at that, and split it. I think it needs to be weaker. Uh, and, uh, right. Over there. There we go. Okay. Now, set this down. We're going over me And we're going to aim it at that. I don't know if I'm going to need to dampen it or not. I am. So now I know. Oh, gotcha. I know what I'm doing. I know exactly what all the things I'm doing in the world. Oh! Well, that's what it did. It opened... Okay, well, that's helpful. Um, now I know. Okay, so the medicines, we got that. What is this? Oh, nothing. Uh, oh. Any stuff in here? It's 
looks like a school. And, uh, oh, I thought that, <laughs> thought those were stormtroopers for a second. I was like, hey, now, wait a minute. Should jot that down. <laughs> okay, toys, and we have a hologram. So let's figure out what story we have in here. What's, what's with the school, my dude? Okay. Um, oh, no. Keep thinking that's the other way. Okay. It's this. There we go. Okay. There you are. I mean, about three others have been looking for you. Aren't you a bit too big for that chair? Huh. These chairs have gone unused for all these years, Isaac. Why is that? Is Nobody wants to have a baby on Mars. A lot of people are fearful they're stressed. of what might happen if they conceive here. Hmm. We still don't know what complications could arise. Humanity evolves because we adapt, not because we stay inert in the face of adversity. If we never try, we'll never know. That's the price we pay. Do you have a family? On Earth? Yes. What do you need, Isaac? <laughs> the, the, the dust storm hit Herschel hard. Uh, until the damage is repaired, we won't have any alloys to continue the housing project. Oh. What about Odom? Uh, we're drafting up a ration plan to see us through the next few months, but, uh... It leaked, and people are refusing to work. I'll talk to Rosa. This homeward nonsense has gone on long enough. Well, why didn't you let her have the psychiatric ward? She could help people. She didn't try to help people. She tried to find weaknesses in the fence. But I'll handle Rosa. I don't really trust the way he's handling Rosa. He... He doesn't seem to be really caring about his people that are here, or that are there on Mars. But he did say something I was interested in. Um, da her dad did. Said, well, the storm hit this place hard, and now we can't go on. It stopped the housing project. Housing project. So I was thinking about that. I was thinking, well, they're not living here. I still don't know why. I mean, they even have a school in here. So they have everything in here they need. I don't know why they'd want to build a housing project, but apparently they are. So are we going to find that? See, there is Oith. There is Mize. And, uh, you know, it's not nearly enough blue on Mars, is there? Well... One of these days, maybe one of these days soon, we're going to live there. I am hoping that by the time, uh, well, I'm hoping that, um, we will have landed people on Mars while I'm still alive, because I'd love to see it. And I don't know if you all knew this, I keep up with space a lot. Um... And while they were just kind of throwing the idea out there, NASA was. We are going back to the moon in 2024. So like in a couple of years, we're going to go, we're back to the moon. I am really excited for that. All right. Um, well, we're not going under there, are we? I thought that we were, but we aren't. Okay, we're going up here. Never mind. Um, wow! <laughs> Frozen. Okay, come on. What is it with you climbing and freezing all the time? Don't do that. Thank you. All right. Uh, get up here. You can climb. I know you can climb. You can climb all over the place. You can jump over here. You can climb on that. Yeah. You are just, you're just a climbing fool. I know you can do it. Oh, wait. This is going to be a little bit... Yeah. See, it's getting tricky on me again. Ah, <laughs> wants me to go between the thing. Oh. There you go. Uh, bonk. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we got this. We got it. 
I don't... I think, yeah, let's go up the middle of this. There we are. Oh, boy. This is gonna be interesting. Wait, no, 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 no. There we are. Okay, go over here. Boom. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry, Bobot. I mean, I know, you know... I know that you're sitting there going, I'm a Bobot. I'm... I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm just a stupid Bobot. But look, you can float. Okay, I'm glad you're watching me. You're probably sitting over there laughing at me right now. It's like, look, it's got to climb. Come on, just just fart really hard. You float on up. I know it's making fun of me in its own head. It is. Um, no. No. Get in there. Okay. We good. Now, where are we? Uh, okay. Oh, no! Ah, uh, that was, uh, I'm not going to blame anything for that. That was me just being dumb. Uh, that was just a, just a mistake. I'm stupid. Okay, let's not do that again. Whoa, there we are. I just jumped too early is all it was. We did, that didn't happen. We, we're not going to count that. Um, can you go? Yeah. Okay. Um, oh, can I make... I better be able to make this. Oh, boy! Okay, we made it. Um, now. So, this is... I was wondering how... You know, what tricks we were going to do to be able to get to the top floor, and it ain't no tricks. We're just going to climb up there. All right. Aha! Oh, perfect. Let's do it. Kerzapity. All right. Uh, what do we? What? What did that even do? Um. Are we okay? bridge, right? I mean, we did want to get to the bridge, so. Cryogenics. Oh! Oh, so we got, okay, we just got the elevator going. Oh, please tell me she's not gonna die. We've already- we've had- we've had enough death in this game already. I'm gonna get some water. Oh. Just go over there and just beat her over the bonk! Does that feel good? No, I wouldn't. You alright? Shut up. Yeah, she's the one that we had that really awkward conversation with, like, you in the first the couple episodes. Beds that I was in on the moon. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. I really tried... ...to fix the MPT with the last bit of Helium-3 there was left. Same bit of Helium-3 that your dad needed to jumpstart the Ark... ...and bring you here. Huh. He caused a five-year blackout. Well, it wasn't just him. One, One choice. Bull, there was hundreds of, there was a hundred of them. Everyone. Oh, come on, Bull. He never intended to cause a blackout. Having good intentions isn't hard, Kathy. Plenty of well-intentioned people have single-handedly caused so much destruction. 
I love it. Her hair still floofs every time I hear it. is knowing the difference between what's right and what's wrong. That is a good point. Claire always knew. Oh. Oh. I just hope you do too. Oh. Ouch. This place could really do with a bar or barricades. Oh, <laughs> oh, Bobots. Bobots want a bar. They just whispered it to me. I, I know they do. I want some Bobot booze, Bobot music, a Bobot stripper dancing around a pole. Alien? Whoa. Looks like one hell of a science fiction machine, all right. I think we can safely assume who created this. Alright, let's split up. Oh, now you want to split up? You didn't want to before. Alright. I'll see if I can crack the main terminal. Ryan, check if we can use that elevator to bypass the stairway. Got it. What do you want me to do? Maybe you can figure out what this thing actually does? Sure as hell is it meant for flight. Okay. We're gonna do that. I, um, oh, uh, patreon.com slash ranting griffin. Gotta say, I, I have to say that. Uh, if, if you like, if you like this green sphere, write this down for later. if you think that green sphere is impressive and sci-fi and very cool, then you gotta go to my Patreon and like, you know, donate a few bucks a month so I can keep doing this. Why? Why? Because you think that's green and it's awesome in sci-fi. Why does that justify you going to my Patreon? It's the only thing I can think of right now. <laughs> but thank you guys if you do go to my uh, Patreon and, and help me out. I really could use it. Although I, I gotta say, I am confused. And I'm, I'm, I don't know if this will be part of the story or not, but they're blaming her dad for everything. But we've been seeing holograms of her dad. Doesn't even look like her dad is in charge. I mean, her dad is an engineer. And her dad did make stuff. Like, some machines and things for them. But he's not controlling the whole thing. And it's like, well, your dad caused a five-year... But was it her dad that even decided to take off? I mean, a bunch of people did. Why was it just her dad that's responsible? I don't know if they're blaming her dad for more than he's responsible for or if there's something I don't know. Either way, I hope we find that out. We're going to find out what this big machine does. I hope that it will make me a corn dog. Guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me again today. We will meet again in the next simulation. Until then.